So this video is a continuation of the video from a couple weeks ago in terms of triage phrase, uh, nurses for the triage nurse. This video is going to show you how to say the basic body parts in the Navajo language. This is going to be a video to continue on with the next video on how to do pain assessment. Where does it hurt? This way you can say my arm hurts, my head hurts. So this first video is just to tell the basic body parts. So to begin. Um, so body in general, body in general is hatsis, hatsis, that's body, hatsis. In some ways, you, in some sen sentences or in some scenarios, you can say hatcha, hatcha, but mainly you say hatsis for the body, hatsis. Um, the head is hatsitsin, hatsitsin. That's a, a head in general. If it's my head, it's shitsitsin, shitsitsin. Or if it's your head, nitsitsin, hatsitsin is head. The face is hani. Hani, and it's low. If you say hani, that means waist. So you want to say hani, face, hani. And in a later video, we may go into the different parts of the face, like eyebrows, eyelashes, eyelids, mouth, but that's another time. Hani, face. Then there's also your neck, hakwas, hakwas. Shikwas is my neck, hakwas. Um, it's a little different if you're saying throat. You don't say hakwas if you're saying my throat hurts. So for throat, it's hatayet. Hatayet. So if you're saying my throat hurts, shatayet honezke. And we'll get to pain next week, but throat is hatayet. And your neck is shikwas. Uh, after that, after that is hawas. The shoulders, hawas. My shoulders, shawas. Then there's hagan, which is the arms, hagan. Or, um, if it's my arm, shagan, then there is hachojla, which is the, the elbow. Hachojla, hachojla. Then there's the wrist, haketsin, no, halatsin, halatsin, that's the wrist, halatsin. And the hand is hala, hala, the hand, hala. The chest area is hayid or hajaitsin, depending on the scenario. But to, to use a word properly, make sure you talk to a fluent Navajo language teacher or a fluent speaker. But either it's hajaitsin or hayid. Hayid. Hajaitsin. Let me see. I want to make sure... I wrote this down so that I would make sure I covered everything down. You know what I mean? Mm hmm So the trunk area is hajit. Hajit. But if you're talking about the stomach in general, it's chabid, chabid, or my stomach is shibid, your stomach, nibid, chabid is the stomach. Let me see. Oh yeah, okay. And then the back, your back is huishgan, huishgan, that's the back. Or if you're saying my back, it's shishgan, shishgan, but back in general is huishgan. Huishgan, that's the back. Huishgan. And then, of course, there's the buttocks, which is hatla. Hatla. Um, let's see. Hajad, that's the legs. Hajad. And then the knee is hagwad. Hagwad, that's the knee. So if it's my knee, it's shagwad. Shagwad. And then there's also the ankles, which is um, haketsin, haketsin, which is the ankles, haketsin. And the foot is hake, hake. And that's the foot, hake. And the other parts of the body, um, there are a lot, of, a lot of different words for each individual part, like the lap or the calf or um, the front part of the leg right here, like um, uh, hajestis, but we'll get into those in another video. Other things, the skin is hakage, hakage, that's the skin. For hair, it's hatsi, hatsi. So my hair would be shitsi. And, and muscles in general is hato, hato, that's muscles, or shito, my muscles, shito. And those are the basic body parts in Navajo. 
And again, this is going to be expanded upon to other things. We're going to go into different parts of the body and we're going to be, in the next video, we're going to talk about pain assessment. Where does it hurt? And that's, and that's going to, all the body parts are going to come into play with that. And that's today's basic medical terminology lesson, the body parts. Gone. And then, of course, there's the buttocks, which is hatla, hatla. Um, let's see. You're supposed to turn around and point. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Yeah, come on. <laughs> um, after that is um, hajad, which is the legs. Hajad.